Most babies at nine months ask for milk by crying, but Emma is slowly learning there are other ways to get what she wants. Emma attends sign language classes with her mother, Melanie, as part of a program to help parents communicate with their pre-verbal babies. With My Smart Hands, the parents learn the alphabet and basic signs through games like Go Fish, asking for cards by signing the word on them. The idea is that parents continue to sign at home, and the babies eventually associate gestures with an object or action. Charlene Slots Gray is the instructor for the London chapter. She says sign language reduces the frustration of trying to communicate, and it not only gets the hands working, but the brain too. I believe in what I do. I believe in it because of what it offers. Again, back to the, you know, the strengthening the bond and the frustration level and things, but primarily for the kids' education. That's what it's all about. It's about giving these kids an early tool on learning how to communicate which again, if you, if you integrate books into it and you integrate music into it, you know, showing parents how to sign to a nursery rhyme or giving them you know, tips and tricks on how to do things, and that will ultimately result in helping a child's education. That's, that's all it needs. One rationale, I think, for why parents and some educators have, have um, advocated the use of sign language in, in very young children is that we know that their comprehension um, of, of language is far ahead of their production of language. So they understand a lot more of the world and of, of what we're saying um, than they can actually produce and demonstrate to us in terms of their own production. At home, Melanie regularly signs to Emma, knowing it's a slow process. You know, they cry a lot and you don't know if it's their diaper or if they're hungry um, or if they're not feeling well. So with, with the sign language, as soon as they start learning it, um, they'll be able to sign, you know, hopefully diaper or milk, eat, something like that. So it, it's nice before they can talk to be able to know what they want. I am so happy that we took it. It was, it was beyond what I expected. Um, it, it's, it's been a wonderful class. I'm so glad we did it. I'm going to recommend it to everyone that I know um, because it is very helpful. They do a wonderful job. After lunch, it's time to lie down. <laughs> Melanie says she plans to continue classes at the next level with My Smart Hands. Signing eases the frustration of trying to understand Emma. Melanie also hopes it will help both of them communicate with Emma's uncle, who is deaf. There have been small improvements since they enrolled in the classes, and you can see that Emma is beginning to understand the importance of some gestures. After sucking on her bottle for a few moments, Emma begins to squeeze and release her left hand doing the sign for milk. I'm Alexis Brown.